Hey guys, Ryan, uh, back again with another video. Today, we are going to mess around with a TRX4 Sport. This truck originally comes with wheels. I had bought the track set, which you can buy separately. It's about $200. Um, we're gonna take it out. We got a little bit of rain yesterday and this morning. So we're gonna take it out and put it through some mud. I've driven this many times and it's been through everything, literally practically a submarine. I wanna show you guys that today. Hopefully nothing breaks, but if you ain't breaking your RC cars, you definitely ain't having fun. Um, fixing them, of course, another part of it. This truck runs for about $350 from Traxxas. If you want something uh, with a little bit more features than just, you know, drive, it's, there's a TRX4 Blazer and a TRX4 Bronco you can buy with a two-speed transmission, uh, and it's got the diff lock feature. Uh, really cool and a lot of fun. I have the 79 Blazer. Uh, had some things done to it, put a lift kit. I got some mudslingers on it. It blew up. Uh, ESC blew. A uh, bunch of other stuff happened. So I send it back to Traxxas. It's on its way now. Everything's fixed. And soon we'll be making videos with that as well. You guys will like that truck a lot. But anyways, we're going to be running this TRX4 Sport with the tracks on it. Um, it's a great truck for beginners. It's not too fast, um, really not too expensive. This truck functions just as a real truck should. As you can tell, you can see everything underneath it. Uh, you know, your, your rods, your drive shaft in the center. Um, it's a sweet truck and it's a lot of fun. And if you don't have one, it's a good truck to have, honestly. Um, you guys will see how it moves. It moves just like a real truck, honestly. Um, but anyway, guys, let's get out there and tear it up. Uh, gonna get some cool slow-mo shots and water shots. We're gonna, we're gonna sink this thing and, uh, hopefully nothing breaks, but if it does, whatever, you know, but anyway, guys, let's get out there and tear it up with the TRX4 Sport. Getting deep right there, guys. We're doing good. Oh, wow, look at that. Look at that. That thing is in there. The turning radius isn't the best. Of course, they're wide track so kind of got to work with what you got let's see how deep we can't get it guys get that angle towards you guys this thing is literally under the water right now this is awesome right here spitting out water almost need a snorkel for this thing so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go around and look for some more trails like i said guys this thing really just takes everything i throw at it it's a great truck there's some more mud right here
Okay guys, we're gonna try a different approach. We're gonna give this guy a little bit of throttle here to clear those roots right there. Oh yeah, like nothing. Great truck. All right, we're gonna see if the TRX4 Sport with the tracks is able to get through this mud pit right here. The whole thing, we're gonna give it, we're gonna give it a go. Ready? Let's go. Hopefully it ain't too deep for it. Let's get out in the middle there though. Oh yeah. Easy. This thing is an absolute beast. Let's bring it around here. You guys can get an idea of that turn radius. It's very wide. Look at that. Just an absolute beast. All right, let's, let's see if we can't climb up this hill also. Kind of big for the truck. Oh, like nothing. Look at those tracks work. So cool. Look at that thing just flex and move. Big drop off right here. Oh. Uh oh. Look at that thing. Absolute beast. Sideways and everything. Uh oh. Look how caked up those tracks are. Actually popped off. I gotta put them back on place. It happens every once in a while. Just got a bunch of mud in there and sand. One thing, if you guys do run these tracks, make sure you clean them out because it's good to have clean stuff, you know? But yeah, look at this beast right here. They sell a winch. I'd like to get a winch for this thing so I can make a video and a clip of the TRX4 Sport right here pulling out my lifted blazer out of the mud just for a sick shot. But look at that thing. Absolute beast. Hey guys, Ryan back here at the house. So as you saw, the TRX4 Trax took everything I thrown at it. This thing was almost completely submerged. All the electronics were submerged in it. Tracks and everything function great out there in the water and mud. Um, yeah, this thing is an absolute beast. So if you want to pick yourself up one, make sure you head over to Traxxas.com. Uh, $350 a piece. Um, all the electronics that I have in it right now are the same electronics that I got when I first, you know, purchased this vehicle. Um, so nothing swapped out other than the, the tracks. That's the only custom part on this truck. Um, but yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, subscribe. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Um, and don't forget to turn those post notifications on if you guys enjoy watching these videos. See you guys.